So we're talking about the RTX 6000 series GPUs before people can even obtain a 50 series GPU. But not only can people not obtain a 50 series GPU, we cannot obtain a 40 series GPU for MSRP either. And then we got people down in the YouTube comments where I go to make a video covering a PC build I just do for $3,600 that includes a 9800X 3D and an RTX 4080 Super. Video right here, it's just got normal stuff. We got a 1250 watt power supply, X870 motherboard, 9800X 3D. This is definitely overpriced right here, the T705. It is the fastest NVMe on the market. Customer wanted that, so that is why I got it. We get to be quiet. AIO and you get my point bro. So now now when I go to make this video on this 9800X 3D PC build which I absolutely love doing building computers is like grown up Legos to me guess what's going to happen you see this computer right there that you're seeing in the background it's just a basic normal high-end computer now comments oh you overpaid for this oh you overpaid for that oh I could have built that for this price brother here's your screenshot of what it cost this is literally what it cost me dude i can't even make a, a video that i like to make because we got a bunch of geniuses that know everything about everything on the planet despite knowing absolutely nothing about everything rtx pro 6000 blackwell you know it i know it everybody on the planet knows it you know why this gpu was released right here is because of this right here the amd ryzen ai max plus 395 strix halo processor absolutely stupid ridiculous name that is just really stupid and ridiculous that's why they released this graphics card that probably once again 99 percent of us will not be able to obtain because nvidia just likes to apparently release things that nobody can obtain it's just something that they really enjoy doing nvidia sells rtx gpus from a quote-unquote food truck this is actually legitimate this isn't even a joke like they're actually doing would you get out of here with your advertisement I just, it really is, man. It's super frustrating right now. Like nothing interests me anymore. We're at a point where nobody, we're, we're at a point, bro. Like just let that sink in. I get it. It's at GDC. It's at an event. They want to like promote their shit. Nvidia cuts RTX 50 series prices across Europe. Oh, let's clickbait the video and tell everybody how Nvidia is finally dropping prices. But guess what? How many of you are actually going to be able to get one with this price drop? Again, like I said the other day, dude, it's on like 20 series. Just let this fucking sink in, man, okay? It's like, okay, please. Like when I said we need to be holding these other online retailers like Amazon, Walmart, Best Buy, Newegg, etc. Like all these like online marketplaces where people buy a thing and resell that thing for five times the amount that it is supposed to cost. Just let this sink in for a moment. You have been complaining about NVIDIA bringing more graphics cards to the market since the 20 series. The 2080, how many of you struggled to get a 2080? I'm going to guess a pretty good majority of you, probably like 50% of you struggled to get a 2080. Then we can go into the 30 or 3090 and 3080. How many of you struggled to get one of those? Probably like 60 or 70% of you. Then we get into the 40 series. How many of you were able to like obtain one of those? I'm going to guess the struggle percentage was like 80 or 90. Now we're at the 50 series territory where 99% of us can't find a graphics card. Like, are we just going to continue to ask for the same thing? Hello, am, am I just like a superhuman genius right here? Are we going to continue to ask for the same thing over and over and over and over again, expecting it to actually happen? Just let this sink in here. Imagine you're sitting here. Look, you, you, got, you open up your video game. You're like, move character. Move character. Please move character. Move to the right over there and shoot the enemy in front of me. Character, please move. And you're sitting here for five years. Move character. Please move character. Can you please move character? There's an enemy right there. Shoot him. Please character move. How about you try something different and you move your mouse? It's been five years. None of us are able to get one. It's actually, as a matter of fact, it's getting even worse. 20 series, 50% of us couldn't get one. 30 series, 70% of us couldn't get one. 40 series, 85% of us couldn't get one. 50 series basically don't even fucking exist. <laughs> Dude, it really is man so like these like price cuts are meaningless
people are becoming more and more and more and more aware. And keep in mind, dude, this is not just NVIDIA and AMD graphics cards. This is the PS5. This is the PS5 Pro. This is the Nintendo Switch. This is the 9800X 3D, the 9958, whatever. This is everything, dude. It's not just graphics cards. <laughs> so what I, what, the reason I said what I said about Amazon, Best Buy, Newegg, and all these other online retailers setting some sort of rule for a, a an amount that you can resell shit for that would that would fix it all dude because people wouldn't go buy 500 590s <laughs> it doesn't matter how many if this is what would happen okay this is what will happen if if nvidia brings more 6000 series gpus to the market this is what's going to happen are you ready for it so let's say just to make the numbers easy let's say nvidia brought a million 50 series graphics cards and now nobody can get one but the 6000 series they release a billion billion as in 1000 million billion okay let again going back to the brick of gold okay now imagine you're a bot you're the you're one of the people with a bot set up on your computer you just bought 550 90s and made two hundred and fifty thousand dollars when the six thousand series gpus releases what are you just going to be like oh hey oh man nvidia just has so many of them now oh geez i well i don't know i guess i'm just like i'm not going to buy 10 times more i'm not going to buy 10 times more and make 2.5 million rather than 250 i'm just going to ignore the fact they released more it, it's okay it's okay. Like it, now, people can get one. So now I can't buy them. Or do you think this is what would happen? Oh shit! I just made two hundred and fifty grand. I'm actually gonna buy like maybe ten thousand this time rather than five hundred. Do you think that's going to happen, or do you think there's oh they released so many this time? I'm just gonna. I I don't want to risk it. If you actually think people are going to do that, you're dumb. I'm sorry, bro, but you're really stupid. <laughs> so there was a big, uh, man, I went on really down, really long time down that rabbit hole. So we're going to kind of speed through all this other stuff. It's all small stuff anyway. Uh, so the NVIDIA app update brought a bunch of DLS overrides. And pretty much in simple terms, there's a lot more customization that you can do with the new uh, NVIDIA application. So if 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 you had, if you do have this, uh, updated AMD also got an update in regards to um, the whatever AMD graphics card stuff. God damn, bro. That's like, I haven't heard of anybody having issues with the 97 year, the whatever, the noon graphics cards. But despite that, that's a lot of stuff right there that they fixed. So if you have an AMD thing, update it and then this really is yeah i just i just wanted to cover this because of this right i'm pretty sure i mentioned it at the beginning here oh damn i didn't even scroll down this far uh so anyways man this is like you know it i know it everybody else on the planet knows it the reason that nvidia nvidia is even like talking about this right now is because of this right here you know like they actually have competition when it comes down to ai and amd is like so the problem with this right here though is that it's so expensive. Like the like you can't get a laptop under three grand with that CPU inside of it. I don't know how much this mini PC is. Dude, this just is so irritating right now. It's so irritating because it's like at the same time, like I literally can't even build computers right now because like the only reason I was able to build this thing is because I actually got lucky and found a used RTX 4080 Super for fifteen hundred dollars. <laughs> And everyone, oh my god, you caved in. That is a steal. It's, dude, it's fucking disgusting that I even have to say. That's a steal for a 4080 right now, dude. <laughs> so, like, it's like, it's like, this is what I'm saying, dude. Like, I go, I'm going to go and upload this, this video on this computer that I built. And I'm going to get comments. Oh, you overpaid for that. Oh, you overpaid for this. Oh, I could have built that for one tenth the amount of money four years ago when shit wasn't four times the amount. It's almost like we're not in 2025 right now.
So like, I it just dude, it it really irritates me when people do that. It's like, okay, so not only did I show you how much I paid for it, okay, not only am I not charging people anything for the computers that I'm building, not only is it 2025 and not 2001 where parts aren't 10 times less than they are right now. It's like, dude, people are living 10 years ago, and then if they, they go in and complain about people that are just living in the, in the now and just like realizing nothing is going to change nothing is going to change the prices you're seeing online nothing is going to change again back to the bricks of gold 550 90s versus 10,060 90s the person with a bot on their computer is not just going to be like oh it, they just released so many this time so i'm not going to buy a lot of them they're just going to see that as a, a bigger opportunity dude I'm going to end the video, man. I've been rambling on for a minute here. Let me know what you guys think about all this stuff.